Hey howdy hey, um, it's me Sam, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing a Drag Race winners speculation season of who I think would win it in all winners season. So if that sounds good to you, make sure to like this video, comment down below who you think would win an all winners season, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And without further ado, let's get this video started. <laughs> So in this, this is all my fantasy world, you know, because it's mine. So I'm going to sort of tell you how it's going to go in my world. In my world, this is a winner's all winner season from all regular seasons of Drag Race. I'm not going to be including all stars in this because all the winners for all stars have already gotten a chance to come back. So this, this is sort of my view on who I think would win an all star, all winners season. All right. So. I'm gonna go through the list of queens first off. Let's let's start from season one. All right, first we have Bibi Zahara Bonet from season one. From season two, since Tyra Sanchez has quit drag, I'm going to include Raven because in my fantasy world that that makes sense. Um, from season three we have Raja. From season four we have Sharon Needles. From season five we have Jinx Monsoon. From season six we have Bianca Del Rio. From season 7, we have Violet Tchotchke. And from season 8, we have Bob the Drag Queen. From season 9, Sasha Velour. From season 10, Aquaria. From season 11, we have Evie Oddly. And from season 12, we have Jada Essence Hall. So for this um, prediction video, I'm going to kind of tell you guys how I see the season going out. If we have the current cast of queens that I just listed for you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and t give you guys some of my early outs. These are all my own views. So if you um, have your own opinion, let me know down below what you think. Um, early outs, I have Violet. I, Violet Chachi, I think, will be an early out just because um, I think she might fade into the background a little bit more when you have other big personalities like Bi like Bianca or Bob or any of the above. Um, just because, especially in season seven, there weren't as many big personalities. So that's why I think Violet was able to do better in that season. Um, but the, the, again, this is my own view on this. Um, I think Raven probably would be an early-ish out. She might come go in a little bit further, but um, I don't know. I mean, it'd be a really good chance for her, I think, to get back on the TV. I mean, she doesn't need to be on it, obviously, because she's currently doing RuPaul's makeup and won an Emmy for it. But, um, I don't know. Maybe that maybe she'll go further. I don't know. Then I have Evie, because I feel like Evie is a great performer. However, as we saw in Snatch Game, she doesn't necessarily have the best, um, comedy aspects. Again, these are all my own views, so let me know down below what you think. Um, but I think Evie will also be an early out, along with Sharon Needles, just because it's been a while since Sharon's been on the show, and I don't think she'll make it very far. Then we have Jada Essence Hall. She's funny, however, she's not as funny as some of the other queens and doesn't stand out as much as some of the other queens that we have in this cast. So that's why I have Jada next. And then we have Bibi, because Bibi's already been on All Stars, and I don't know how well she would compete against people like Jinx or Bob or Bianca or any of the above, you know? It's just my view on that. Next, I have Sasha Velour in sixth place. Um, I think she'll make it pretty far. I don't think she would win. Um, and I don't think she'd be top three or anything like that. Um, but we'll see if this were to ever happen, obviously. Then I have Raja. I think Raja has really good aesthetics. And I think she'd be able to do well with that aspect. Um, not necessarily the best in the comedy or things, improv or things like that. But I tend to favor those queens in general, comedy queens, if I'm being honest with you guys. If you can't tell from this um, list already, I tend to favor those. Next, I have Aquaria, because Aquaria can do comedy. However, she's not the best, obviously, but um, she also knows how to pull together a look. She knows how to stand out pretty well. So I think Aquaria would make it pretty far. And my top three is Jinx Monsoon, Bianca Del Rio, and Bob the Drag Queen. So I think this is a pretty 
easy top three to pick out. It might be a bit predictable. However, this makes sense if you think about it. Um, just because they're all so, um, such big personalities and they all really stick out and they all do super well in comedy and runway and everything. So yeah, um, as far as the winner, in my head, it's either Bianca or Bob. Um, however, again, these are all my own views, so let me know down below who you think would win. Um, also, we're probably not going to be getting this season for a long time, if we ever do. Um, as much as I would enjoy this season, and I think it would be really fun to watch, um, I don't think we would get it for a while. Um, in terms of what's coming next in Drag Race, though, we're going to sort of have to see what comes out in 2021. Obviously, we're getting season 13, probably going to be early in 2021. And we're also getting All-Stars 6. Yeah, All-Stars 6, um, also in 2021. And then I assume we're probably going to get another season of Drag Race UK, another season of Drag Race Holland, and maybe another season of Drag Race Canada, and also maybe Drag Race Australia. I've heard rumors about that, but I don't know if that's official or anything. Um, but that's sort of my what next year is going to look like as well. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel for more Drag Race videos. Um, whenever any new season comes out, I will be covering it for you guys. I always try to be the first one to put videos out for you guys. So, um, as soon as you want to see a video, I will probably have one out. Um, and yeah. Again, I am still reviewing Drag Race Holland. Um, we are two episodes away, but I'm still reviewing it, even though we already know who's going to win at this point. Like, if it's not who we think it's going to win, then there's some issues there. Um, anyways... Uh, yeah, that's about it. Um, make sure to like this video if you liked it. Comment down below what you think of my predictions for an all-winner season. It probably won't happen for a long time. And if it does happen, it might include all-stars. Winners, we will see. I guess it all depends on who would actually be willing to come back to compete. Because not all the winners are super eager to compete again, I don't think. Um, but again, obviously, we'll see. So, yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And have a great rest of your night, your day, wherever you are. And I'll see y'all later. Bye, guys.